Algebra 1A students. I am your teacher, Miss Moore. Uh, welcome to the new school year. I'm very excited to be your math teacher. I just wanted to do a little introduction video to help you get familiar with the layout of the class and um, what our course is going to look like. So I'm gonna go ahead and share my screen. So again, welcome. I am Miss Moore. Just a little bit about me. Um, I went to school at UC Irvine. I got my single subject math credential there and my master's in teaching there. Um, this is my 11th year teaching math. It goes by fast. Um, I've taught in um, Santa Ana Unified School District and then Valverde Unified School District. And then about two years ago, I came to Elite and I absolutely love working here if you need to contact me. So you can contact me directly in Canvas. Um, you can call me at the phone number listed there. It's 866-354-8302. I'm extension 716. Or you can email me at amore at eliteacademic.com. All the ways you can get in touch with me. The materials you're going to need for this course um, is the Algebra 1A workbook and the Algebra 1A notes workbook. So I don't have it, but I have mine from last semester for geometry. So it's gonna look like this, has tabs for each unit. Um, this is all the work that you're going to be completing. And then there's a smaller one that you'll be getting, which says Algebra 1A notes. It's smaller and there's just um, blank pages in there for you to copy down the notes. Um, as I teach you in the videos. So I'm hoping as you're watching this, you have it. If you don't, um, your teacher of record should have ordered it and you should be getting it shortly. If you um, aren't sure, go ahead and get in touch with me or with your teacher of record and just ask and make sure that it's been ordered because you need it right away. The assignments are in that workbook. And then the notes, we wanna copy them all down in one place. So we really want you to have the notes workbook and the workbook from the beginning as soon as possible. Okay, so the layout of the class. Um, the first two weeks, we're just gonna be learning all of the new material. So I'm gonna introduce the material. Each um, topic has a instructional video that I've created where I teach it to you. As you're watching that video, you're gonna copy down the notes in your notes workbook. Then in the other workbook, there's going to be an assignment for you to practice what you've just learned. Uh, once you complete that, then you're gonna journal. Uh, you're going to explain what you've learned. You're gonna walk me through a problem step-by-step. Step. It's a way for me to assess your learning. If you're struggling, you're gonna show me where you get stuck, ask any questions. It's really, I know it's math, but it's good to write. It really helps. Um, as you're learning the material. Uh, the last week of each unit, the third week, you're going to apply what you've learned to, these are, these are a little bit more difficult, they're application problems and problem solving. So you're gonna apply those skills that you've learned the, the first couple of weeks and you're going to apply those to uh, real world problems. At the end of that week, you're going to get ready for your unit test by completing a study guide, which is gonna review everything from the unit and then the unit test. So um, the unit test and the study guide will be in Canvas. They're not on paper in the workbooks. They're going to be in Canvas and also checkpoints. So at the end of, or after a couple topics, um, I wanna assess where you're at. So there are some checkpoints also throughout. It's a three week unit. So at the end of the first week, there will be a checkpoint in Canvas. And then at the end of the second week, there will be another checkpoint. And then at the end of the third week is when you'll do the unit test. I will be having um, Algebra 1 live instruction every Wednesday from 11 to 11.30. Oh, it says 11 to 11.30 p.m., 11.30 a.m. Okay, so in the morning, 11 o'clock, I will fix that. Um, it's really important for you to attend. You're gonna, we're gonna go over a lesson together. Um, you can ask questions. You can uh, get to know the other students in the class. Um, it'll be short and sweet, just 30 minutes. We'll try to play games and make it fun. So I hope to see all of you there. There's the Zoom link. And I will also, it's also posted on our 
Canvas page. Targeted tutoring every Tuesday from 1 p.m. to 1.45 p.m. I will be pulling in groups of students that seem to be struggling on a certain topic. If you receive an invitation from the calendar to attend this, it's very important that you attend because your grade is um, in jeopardy. So the whole purpose of this is to just help you get your grade up, turn in any missing assignments, redo a test maybe that you didn't do so well on or a checkpoint. I'll be pulling in groups of students that are struggling on the same assignment or the same test or the same checkpoint. And it's an opportunity for you to raise your grade. So take advantage of those opportunities and make sure you attend. I also am offering one-on-one -on -one tutoring on Tuesdays and Thursdays from 9 a.m. to 12 p.m. So anytime, if you just really don't understand how to solve equations by elimination um, or systems of equations by elimination, you can book um, a one-on-one -on -one appointment with me. It's called Calendly is what we use. You just click that link. It'll show you available times that I have on Tuesdays and Thursdays and you just book it and then I get a notification and then we meet at that time that you chose. So um, I hope to see you guys for one-on-one -on -one tutoring as well. So that's it for my slideshow. And then I also just wanted to show you Canvas in case, oops, wrong one, in case you're not familiar with it. So um, you can go to courses and then you'll click Algebra 1A and then it'll take you to this homepage. And so everything you're gonna need is on here. And so we're starting with week one. So your first assignment is gonna be adding and subtracting integers. That'll be um, Wednesday's assignment. And then Thursday's assignment is adding and subtracting integers continued. So you'll see um, a lot of the assignments go on for two days. So the first day you don't have to turn anything in. You're gonna watch the video. You're gonna copy down the notes. And then you're gonna get started on the assignment. So you're gonna work on numbers one through 24 today, and then tomorrow you're going to complete it. And that's when you'll upload your work all together. So it saves some uploading. You'll see here, and that's why that first day is worth zero points. But then the second day you get 10 points for the notes and you get 10 points for the completed assignment. So you'll complete that assignment on page two by completing numbers 25 through 50. And then you're going to um, click the blue submit button on the top right hand corner. And it looks like they changed it right here. So you're gonna click right here. You're gonna select the picture of your work and then select it and you'll click choose. And then once it's here, you'll just click submit assignment. So a quicker way to do it when you're doing it on your computer, you might have to take a picture on your phone and then email it to yourself and then access it here. If you download the Canvas app, I highly recommend using the Canvas app. It's much quicker because your picture is already on your phone. And so you go to upload file and you just can pick the picture and upload it. it it's about it's like half the time. So if you can do that, um, use, use that app. If you go back to home, you'll see your first checkpoint is on September 8th. These checkpoints, when you see the little rocket ship, that means it's in Canvas. You don't have to upload anything. You just click on it. You take the quiz. You do the problem. You select if it's A, B, C, or D. And then after you've completed all 10, you will hit the submit quiz button on the bottom right and you're done. That's it for the assignment. So hopefully that was a general overview. Hopefully you're not overwhelmed. Um, we'll, I'll go over it again at the first live session too to help you get familiar. We'll play a little game. Um, so I'm really looking forward to working with you this um, year. It's going to be a good year. Um, and I will see you guys at the live sessions and tutoring. I hope to see you there as well.